Various metal supporting wall structures can be used for attaching the facade cladding. For example, a sheet pile profile. Attach the sheet pile profile to the structure concerned. Optimal ventilation is achieved behind the cladding as a result of the sheet pile profile. Another option is an omega profile. Attach the omega profile directly to the anchoring base. An omega profile can be used if it involves monolayer fixing structure and so no insulation is used. Aluminium supporting wall structures are most commonly used. Attach the wall supports directly above each other. Place the cladding insulation and cut them to shape where there are wall supports. Place the vertical profiles. The wall bracket ensures the profiles can be easily positioned. Then fix the profiles by means of self-tapping screws. When using anodized aluminium, the seams are already aesthetically coloured, for example in black. Spray the back of the facade panel and the supporting wall structure, and then wipe off in one direction with paper or a clean cloth. After which, allow the LT cleaner to thoroughly evaporate for 5 to 10 minutes. Determine the size. Apply the LT tape. With a thickness of 3 mm, the tape ensures good adhesion and guarantees the required thickness of the glue score. Apply a glue score of at least 8 by 8 mm. Remove the LT tape protective layer. Position the panel facade within 10 minutes. Press the panel gently against the adhesive to make any adjustments. Then firmly press into place. While doing so, ensure the facade panel makes good contact with the LT tape. If desired, place joint profiles between the facade's panels. Apply the other facade panels in the same way. Using distance blocks is useful to position the panels evenly. The final result guarantees the most attractive facade. Optimal stress distribution under all weather conditions. Optimal ventilation. And the invisible attachment gives the facade an aesthetically responsible exterior.